They say all roads lead to Rome, everything else leads back to Suma, the cradle of civilization. First to do everything, art, science, and yet even religion. History has recorded many lesser gods. Do you know the most influential one of all? If you could ask an ancient wise man known as the Magi, he would tell you this. Long ago there lived a great man named Zoroaster. He followed one god named Ahiramathana, the great creator and architect with the help of many blessed angels. He opposed the devil named Angra, Mania, the pervert, of anything holy demons of all kinds spread the hate also called Zarathustra. His birthplace is uncertain, but his teachings spread across the Persian Empire and more. He is credited with the authorship of the Gathas, kings which are at the liturgical court of the Magi. Makes the date of his books the old of best in Gathas is unknown. Classical writers such as Plutarch propose dates prior to 6000 BC. Others assume it must be following Alexander the Great's conquest of the Achaemenid Empire in 330 BC. If you ask the Magi, it goes all the way back to the beginning. Today, with modern Zoroastrian people, their message reads good thoughts, good words, good deeds, truly a path worth taking, but take heed and beware good intentions. The Magi, Mystery, Astrology. Babylonian was the first organized system of astrology. First key and sign of the Magi you will see across the globe. 70 cuneiform tablets, 7,000 celestial omens. Gods were also believed to present Jupiter, Venus, Saturn, Mercury, and Mars were recognized. See the sign of Magi, tradition adapted across the globe from Egypt, South America, Rome, the medieval, and even modern times. Archaeoastronomy the study of how people in the past have understood the phenomena in the sky. Archaeoastronomy methods are key to uncover evidence of the Magi, archaeology, anthropology, astronomy, statistics and probability, and history. Even astronomer Gerald Hawkins, who proposed that Stonehenge was a Neolithic computer, none can't doubt it was built by the power of the Magi. Egypt since the first precise cardinal orientations of north south east west line to the pyramids various astronomical methods have been proposed even the map of the three stars in the belt of the right hand. It is clear that a special shadow does appear to make eight sides visible as seen from above. So this is key to understanding it was built by power of the Magi, South America. Kubulkan S. Pyramid is a Mesoamerican step pyramid built in the modern center. It has 365 steps, possibly one for each day of the year. A visually striking effect is seen every March and September as an unusual shadow occurs on the equinoxes. The shadow appears to descend the northern stairway and it was built by the power of the Magi. Coral Castle, Coral Castle created by Edward Lee Skelton in Florida. The structure comprises numerous metal effect stones, each weighing several tons. He uncovered the secrets of how to build the pyramids. He also left an important clue to how he did it. For Magi text will remain in every library on Earth, so Coral Castle was also built by the power of the Magi. Methodism, the mystery religion practiced in the Roman Empire from about the 1st to 4th centuries. Fadi, the initiates called themselves those the united by the handshake. They met in underground temples which survived in large numbers even found in America. The Romans themselves regarded the mystery as having linked back to the secrets of the universe and the power of the Magi. Eclipse. So far the largest Magi creation that detects this shadow effect is an eclipse. It's an extremely rare occurrence when an astronomical object is temporarily obscured to this degree. This effect of the Moon and Earth is not permanent as the distances change over time. So those living on the Earth right now will be the only ones to witness this giant sign pointing that is what's built by the power of the Magi. Religion, the epic of Gilgamesh, an epic poem from Mesopotamia, is amongst the earliest surviving works linked to Genesis and the Garden of Eden and Noah's blood. In both, a man is created from the soil by a god, and lives in a natural setting amongst the animals, he is introduced to a woman to tempt him. In both stories the man accepts food from the woman, covers his nakedness, and must leave his former realm, unable to return. The presence of a snake that steals the plant of immortality from the hero, Genesis 6-8 matches so closely, 
few doubt that it derives from a Mesopotamian account. What is particularly noticeable is the way the Genesis flood story follows the Gilgamesh flood tale point by point and in the same order even when the story permits other alternatives. Gnosticism, primarily defined in a Christian context. Now scholars include early Christianity, Neoplatonism, Hellenistic Judaism, greco roman mystery religions, and Zoroastrianism and all linked to the power of the Magi. Judaism, the points of resemblance between Zoroastrianism and Judaism are many and striking. Both monotheistic religions, the two agree in cosmological ideas. The six days of creation, mankind, according to each religion, is descended from a single couple like Adam and Eve, and all linked to the power of the Magi. Early Christianity, the Magi also referred to as the three wise men in Christian tradition, the group of distinguished foreigners visited Jesus after his birth, bearing gifts of gold, frankincense and birth. They are regular figures in traditional accounts of the nativity celebrations of Christmas and are an important part of Christian tradition. Gospel of Matthew the Magi were the first religious figure to worship Jesus a link back to the power of the Magi. Unknown heirs of Jesus other than a generic statement that after he was 12 years old Luke to 42 Jesus advanced in wisdom and stature, and in favor of God and man Luke to 52 the New Testament has no other details regarding the gap. Modern scholarship has generally rejected any travels by Jesus to India, Tibet or surrounding areas as without historical basis. Since the Magi were so prevalent in his early life one would assume they would not stop there. With no further mention of the Magi near Jesus in the Bible, the missing years is an obvious removal of further influence on him. And all linked to the power of the Magi. In Islam, citing the 8th century al Kalbi, Zarathustra was an inhabitant of Palestine, and a servant of one of the disciples of the prophet Jeremiah. Quran, and we did send apostles before thee. There are some of them that we have mentioned to thee, and there are others whom we have not mentioned to thee. 40, 78. Accordingly, some Muslims do treat the founder of Zoroastrianism as a prophet and he is linked to the power of the Magi. Quest Kotal, some say that Ketsal Kuala was tall and light-skinned, and had an epic beard, in contrast to the natives who were short, dark-skinned few with any hair on their face. These accounts were actually based on first Magi visiting those areas. Spanish chroniclers from the 16th century claim that when the conquistadors led by Francisco Pizarro first encountered the Incas they were greeted as gods, by Ricochas because their lighter skin and beard resembled and all linked to the power of the Magi. In Hinduism, Hindu itself is actually a Persian word coined by Cyrus the Great the Magi in the 6th century BC to describe people who lived beyond the Remoranthus which was the eastern boundary of the ancient Persian Empire. They share rituals, worship of gods bearing identical names such as the Tuf and Yuma, elements of both polytheism and monotheism, ritual chanting, the three-tier universe consisting of upper, middle and lower regions, the concept of divine moral order, the conflict between good and evil, division of time into four periods in which good will progressively decline and evil would ascend to a point where God's intervention would become necessary. The concept of heaven and hell. Wing disc. For most, it is linked to the power of the Magi. The Theron heart means a huge mass in Zoroastrian Persia, symbol associated with divinity and royalty in the ancient Near East, Egypt, Mesopotamia, Persia, South America, as well as Australia gods of Egypt were considered to be aspects of the sun disk, 8th century BC, it's the Hebrew seal for power. Shown as a winged sun flanked by two, Egyptian, on in Greece the winged sun is on the staff of Hermes. This also represents the Magi key to unlocking the secrets of the universe. Various groups such as Freemasonry, Theosophy, Rosicrucians and Unity Church have also used it. Variations of this symbol are used as a trademark logo on vehicles today. Phoenicia, an ancient Semitic civilization with colonies across the globe. They carried the wing disc with them and the all Magi teachings. Cuneiform writing even located on bowls on the bottoms of sacred lakes in South America. Ezekiel's wheel, 
is he deal with one of the Jews who were exiled to battle the home of the Magi at the age of 30, Ezekiel described his calling to be a prophet by going into great detail about his encounter with God who rode upon the chariot of four wheels within wheels. As you can see this is a perfect match for many wing discs used by the Magi. King Tut and Great Tackle. Compare this Great Tackle to Lid 2 and Obscure Egyptian equivalent. Each show of chairs with energy on the bottom. Each have hands at controls. Each heavy instrument for life. Interestingly the depiction in South America has a much stronger influence towards scales of a reptile rather than the dominant feathered version of the disc. This could be details of what it looks like on the inside of a winged disc or maybe even a Magi technology similar to the chair found in the Hollywood movie The Matrix. Historical cover-up Most famous example is the Sphinx and the Missing Cat Stone. This was done to hide that it was built by the Magi. Many other occurrences of sabotage damage have been done to hide the return to the Magi monotheistic ways in the past. The ancient library of Alexandria was one of the largest and most significant libraries. The library is famous for having been burned, resulting in the loss of many scrolls and books, and has become a symbol of knowledge and culture of the Magi destroyed. The first emperor of China, unified China in 221 BC, his chancellery SI suggested suppressing the intellectual discourse to unify all thoughts and political opinions. This resulted in the burning of most of the Magi text in the surrounding regions. The Spanish conquest of the Aztec Empire was one of the most significant events in the Spanish colonization of the Americas, during which most of the Magi texts were burned or stolen and regarded as the works of the devil or anger menu. The National Museum of Iraq located in Baghdad contains precious relics from the Mesopotamian civilization. It was robbed and forbidden with military-like precision on the first day of the USA war against Iraq, Untold amounts of treasures of Magi were held here bigger than any weapon of mass destruction. George Smith achieved worldwide fame by his translation of the Great Flood in March, 1876. The trustees of the British Museum sent Smith once more to excavate the rest of Usher Bonnie's Elf Library. Shortly after, he fell ill with dysentery and died. Since his sudden death, the majority of the templates remained locked away from public view. Only small amounts of basic day-to-day -day task lists have been released. Even an exhibit released to Toronto in 2013 was off-limits for photographs. The Antikythera mechanism is an ancient analog computer designed by the Magi to calculate astronomical positions. It was recovered in 1900-1901 from the Antikythera wreck but its significance and complexity were not understood until a century later. Even today the Magi clues inside are still being discovered. Jacques Cousteau visited the wreck in 1978 but he found the wreck had already been dismantled to prevent any further clues. Lastly what remains the largest collection of Magi teaching, the secret Vatican archive. An impressive effort to collect and hide as many of these documents they could find around the world. The power within this library might still rival the weapons of any nation on earth. secret societies. Everyone has wondered if secret societies really rule the world. Those who look find the Freemasons. They only accept members who believe in God. They do not discriminate from what religion you are because they know they all are branches of the first appeared Mahuna, but publicly deny it. Members become kings and presidents including the USA. For most Franklin D. Roosevelt went on behalf of the Masons to Oak Island. That is where he recovered the Ark of the Covenant for them. Masons had the entire White House demolished on the inside so that it could hold the Ark for safekeeping. Since containing it, the U.S. it has used its Magi power to become the world's greatest superpower even against all odds. This is however not the recent development, even since the first kings and queens were puppets actually under Magi control. Greatest example being Cyrus the Great Magi whose rule remains even today after all his relief is good example of this secret if you look closer at what it
stand for his symbol and that of the Mesa did the same. Also type the name of Cyrus's god, the Kiridamana, into Amazon and look what you find. It reveals the connection to the secret of Freemasons or just check the most expensive books on eBay and you will also find the Magi text. Secret Space Program. In our modern times, space exploration has been limited to TV science fiction, but still great future visionary like Gene Roddenberry predicted. Cell phones. Scatters, but was he wrong about man's progress exploring space? I think not for he left us clues to that as well. Season for Star Trek The Next Generation Episode 14 called Clues explains it well an ancient advanced race used fault probe data and other cover means to stop space exploration so their existence can remain a secret shortly. After this episode aired on national television he died of a sudden heart attack at age 70. Another great future visionary filmmaker was Stanley Kubrick. He worked closely with NASA and fueled fire that he knew more about space than anyone else. He also, like Robin Mary, left a message to portray his belief of who was really in charge of space. He chose the opening theme, Song of Great Film 2001 Space Odyssey. The truly epic song he chose is called No Other Than Zarathustra. Another clue of the Magi to who is the real ancient alien, great like Roddenberry, he died suddenly of heart failure at age 70. NASA debunked NASA infamously known as never a straight answer originally not top secret. 1964 was the last mission to be open to public after awards all missions were classified and immune from any oversight and under direct Magi control spending cuts has claimed by some have never been an issue for NASA to hear they have actually got a trillion dollars of taxpayer money in the past five decades. This year alone over 20 billion dollars despite having no work. After the shuttle and space station were a complete failure they cancelled all space programs years ago. They even attempted to shut down the Hubble telescope and were barely saved by public outrage. Their plan for exploration was turned from manned programs to robots. Then, the diminished the robots were altered to have no tools to explore. Currently, their best curiosity over has HD video camcorders on its mass camp and high speed internet connection and even new power. Yet, they refuse to release video or audio from the surface, and instead, we are given fake images of drilling hawks taken from the Earth. They also release computer animations of what the rover is doing instead of providing any evidence that it's really even on Mars. Word around the Gulf Circuit is there is no D times open anywhere near any NASA facility because they never did any work. Instead, we are privileged to view music videos of their spending spree on sports cars, dancing girls, and intern orgy parties. Anyone who has done their own research into the moon landings finds all scientific data is wrong. Even things as simple as telemetry are missing. Video that proves moon landing went missing for decades and is riddled with errors when found moon rock that were returned later turn out to be fossilized wood. Then ones tested to be real rock were actually meteors picked up of the ground in North Pole by Van Brown the Nazi. Most shockingly, the only modern photo evidence to support NASA is so blurry. This from a satellite technology that can read your shirt from orbit. One member of the Apollo crew stood up and called the whole program a lemon. Shortly after the cabin fire broke out on the next launch pad test, he and other crew were killed and promptly replaced ending any further whistleblower testimony. Family members still call for an independent investigation into the accident. Agenda we can see that Magi are not all evil and they have done many good deeds for mankind. But we can also not ignore the clear agenda by some of them that abuse the Magi power. Not long ago, the Spanish took all the gold from America and loaded it on ships. Most sank to the bottom of the ocean. As for the gold that was lost on the bottom of the ocean, later divers found the ships picked clean and the gold was never seen again. During the American Civil War all of the gold went missing and the gold was never seen again.
during the world wanted the American public was robbed of their gold by their own government and stored in Fort Knox. Later when asked to see the holdings were still safe it was discovered that it was all gone except for one small room. The rest of the gold was never seen again. Years after the war Fort Knox was still being used as a gold depository. Yet again when asked for an audit it was refused meaning all the gold was missing. The gold was never seen again. Often overlooked that during the September 11th attacks the World Trade Center was robbed. It held another of the nation's largest gold deposits and had their stock loaded onto trucks and driven out in underground tunnels. This was only discovered by the fact that one truck had gotten a flat tire and what left abandoned in the case to escape the collapse. The gold was never seen again. Lastly, the world financial system entrusted the Federal Reserve and the U.S. in the store of gold. In 2013 countries like Germany asked for reassurance their gold was safe and they were denied. This leading to the fact that the reserve has no gold left it is all missing. Gold was never seen again. Facts show that the gold mining on earth has been going for thousands of years. There should be enough to paint every street on the globe over three feet thick. Yet the most people will see in one place in a lifetime is less than a pound. Most of the world's gold is missing. Gold was never seen again. Tracing the whereabout of this missing gold all leads to one place area 51, the world's largest Magi facility to this day it remains off limits to all even the president of USA is not allowed to enter. If seen from public satellite it has the world's largest runway. Long enough for the old shuttle to land with no breaks. Plenty long enough to ship away all of our world's gold to space. It is now officially acknowledged to exist in the year 2013. The number of presidents who opposed their country's slavery decided to fight back against the Magi. Kennedy does so boldly in his last public address which after he was abruptly silenced. Don't let the work of so many good people to expose the Magi mystery go unheard demand the truth and you must demand accountably. Secrecy helps nobody but the Magi.